Hey, we're Ash, and uh, we've got some tour tips for you. Number one, uh, I think we'll start with merchandise. So, you know, every, everyone usually, usually traditionally, we don't make most of our uh, merch money through cash. You know? But not everyone does have cash. A lot of people have got credit cards, and I guess these little square boxes, or the little square readers now, stick it in your phone, all of a sudden you can take credit cards. And we have like tripled our merch income just from using it. Another modern technological one, uh, well, Hotwire, I think it seems to be a good website for uh, getting hotels on the day of a show. Or on last the day, minute. yeah, last minute. Last minute hotels, you really some, cheap, you get some good good hotels for, for low, low prices. And also, uh, we've been touring with Wi Fi, and like this van's got Wi Fi, and that's transformed our touring life in a lot of ways. Long drives become a lot shorter. Yeah, so that's pretty amazing. That's number three. Four, I guess warm ups is pretty. I, I carry one of the <laughs> something like this. Not maybe this this brand, but sometimes you know, all the time. It's, it's really annoying to listen to for us, but um, I don't know. It's just playing wise. It's warming up before shows sometimes can make a difference, especially also, as the shows get longer. Yeah. Also for your vocals as well. Yeah, vocal warm ups. Yeah. But sometimes you know if you. If you haven't done a show in a day, you've had a long drive, you get out of the van, the first thing you do is get up there and play. Like the first song can be a little bit rusty. So if you're warmed up and ready to go from the off, it makes for a much better show. We need one more. Um, always, tr always try and eat good, and always try and eat like a, a good long time before the show. You don't want to be go going on stage with a big bloated belly full of pizza. <laughs> yeah. pizza. If you like food, enjoy. use your days off to enjoy food and just get fuel in on the uh, show days. I also got a psychological one though. When you're playing shows and um, just don't let it, if you're not having a good one or you think it's bad, don't let it show, you know, don't just get on with it. I mean, a lot of times I thought, oh, that was a terrible show and people come and go, that was great, or, you know, it's absolutely fine. And you can just make it much worse if you kind of show it. So, I mean, just, you know, get on. But that's something you just learn from playing all the time. Or indeed from watching five top tips. <laughs>